Princess Qajar, an iconic beauty symbol of Persia. Beauty is relative, and it depends on the eyes that sees it. Some prefer thin women, and others with more curves. Every day, there are people who try to embarrass others, calling them ugly, without knowing that we are all beautiful in our own way. And no one has the right to judge another person for their appearance. We presume to you the Princess Fatime Kanum, better known as Princess Qajar. She was the daughter of Nasir al-Din Shah Qajar, who reigned Persia from 1848 to 1896. She was a beauty model in those days, without having the body that a woman is supposed to be today. In 19th century, it was common for women to wear a mustache and unibrow. Although she looked like one, she was not a man. She was one of the most influential women in the Qajar dynasty. She was a very strong and brave woman. She was one of the most photographed women of King Nazir. The majority of her photos were taken by her husband. Her father trusted her so much that she was responsible to serve the invited woman of the court. Princess Qajar was not afraid to take risks and went against tradition. She learned to play the piano and became a photographer. But there was another princess of the Qajar dynasty who also would change the history of women in Persia. Princess Sara Khanum, she was the stepsister of Princess Fatemi. Taj did much more things than her sister. She spent her time doing things that women don't use to. She was the pioneer of women's rights in Persia, a feminist fighter. She found the Women's Freedom Association. She found the Women's Freedom Association. She organized reading classes in her home every week. She was the first woman to take off the hijab and give the Qajar dynasty normal clothes. They were the beginning of the change. And they proved to all of us that the real beauty is inside.